Hi, I'm Karen Shamas. I'm your astrologer. Today I talk about Monday the 15th of uh, March. Today the moon is in Aries. Today is a good day if you are a fire sign, if you're Aries, if you're Leo, if you are uh, Sagittarius. How is it going to be for all signs starting with Aries? Today Aries is the king the queen it's a beautiful day it's an easy day it's very welcoming it's very um uh, empowering and enlightening also so you can be actually the center of attention and you can also be the center of motivation for everybody including yourself if you want to decide on anything if you want to be decisive on anything today is the day you may even get some great news today Taurus, it's a slow day. You may not get what you want. You may actually be a little bit uh, disappointed with some results. You expect something better and then you get uh, something less. Uh, this is the quality of time today. That's why on such a day you're not supposed to launch your project or embark on something important because the quality of time is not big enough. It's not important enough to move forward. Uh, like to pull something important. So just relax, enjoy a quiet, easy routine day, especially if you were born on 28th, 29th of April. Moving now to uh, Gemini, I think Geminis today are able to communicate with important people to them. So you can actually reach out to them. You can discuss important things. You can embrace people. You can embrace their beliefs and you can actually join some humanitarian effort. I think Gemini's today are very capable and you're very important to your job, to your community, wherever you are. Uh, you have to believe in yourself. I know you believe in, in yourself because because I know how, how it's been going on with Gemini's and today is a very encouraging day. So uh, don't sit back and watch, join, be helpful. Even if you're working online, whatever you're doing, it's a beautiful day. However, because planet Mars is in your sign, be careful if you were born on the 27th, 28th of May. Moving now to Cancer with the moon in uh, Aries. I think Cancerians today may feel as if they are moving mountains. This is a very important day. You can actually move a mountain. You can excel in what you do. You can reach what you want to do. You can be very important and you can reach the top of this mountain if you don't want to move it. This is a beautiful day, very important. There is some kind of fluctuations with the mood, but. I think you can uh, handle it easily. It's a, a good day for those who are really embarking on something important. On the other side, there may be some um, mood changes, ups and downs, or maybe you feel a little bit um, stressed out or maybe a little bit anxious. But you can be very lucky if you were born on the, six, on the 16th, uh, 17th of July. Let's move now to uh, Leo. I think Leo today is a very nice day. It's a very helpful day. It's a very, it is a creative kind of day. It opens doors for you. It removes all obstacles. It helps you to move out. It has been tough for the past four or five days, but today is um, it's kind of a wake up call and you can move forward. It's as if you're crossing barriers. So today is a very important day and it's very lucky, especially if you were born on the 13th, 14th or 15th of August. Moving to Virgo, I think Virgos today, they are coming out of the tunnel. It has been, it was tough on, on, on Saturday and Sunday for most of you or for some of you. It was tough. It was like living a, a special experience. Uh, today is uh, like standing on your feet, watching things from a little bit afar and trying to uh, evaluate, uh, assess whatever happened and to make a move. And I, I, I think you should move into the direction of, uh, of uh, reaching out to others and making things happen instead of separating. Try to get things together. I think you can make it just negotiate a little bit, but flexibly and you can win. You can be very lucky if you were born on the 31st of August, 1st, 19th, 20th of September. Moving to Libra, I think Libras today may feel tired, may feel stressed out because the moon may bring out, may attract some, maybe some discussions, important discussions, or maybe some stressed um, situations. 
or stressful situation. So you have to be in the play. You have to flow with it. You cannot sit and block yourself. You have to be open to ideas. It's a good day if you want to reach an agreement. If you want to look for trouble, this is the best day. But if you don't want trouble, and usually Libras don't look for trouble, today is a day that will teach you how to be flexible. But you have to decide on being flexible. So be flexible and you will win. No matter what happens, you can win, especially if you were born on the 3rd, 4th, 13th, 14th, 15th of October. Moving to Scorpio, I think Scorpios today are um, very important um, um, part of any organization. Today you're strong, today you're powerful, today you are able to move mountains. This is true. Uh, it's a long day though. Uh, things may not come to you on a silver platter, but I'm, I'm sure that you can actually um, build something, construct something. Uh, start from even zero, although you're not starting from, from zero, but everything is very easy for you to reach. So all you have to do is decide on your schedule and move forward with it and you will not regret it. Just be a little bit more flexible if you were born on the 31st of October or 1st of November. And it's going to be very easy if you were born on the 16th, 17th of November. Okay. Sagittarius, because the moon is in another fire sign, it's an Aries. I think today, I think you're going to be laughing a lot. You're going to be happy. You're going to enjoy things. You're going to laugh at uh, serious things. Uh, so you're taking it lightly, which is great because Saturday and Sunday were a little bit tough on you. So today is a kind of uh, a fun kind of day. And so you're going to be entertained. You're going to entertain yourself. You're going to find beauty even in quarrels and in, in, in differences. Uh, this is a very good day for parents. It's a great day for all people, for everybody. Um, if you want to change scenery, this is also a great day. It is a lucky day. But because planet Mars opposes you, just try to be a little bit more patient with others if you were born on the 28th, 29th of uh, November. Moving to Capricorn, I think Capricorns today are strong. And you are the pillar, pillar, you are the rock of your family, of people who count on you. So Capricorns today, you're strong, you're powerful, you know what to do, uh, uh, and you can actually uh, build something. Uh, you can actually um, start from scratch. If you're building something, an idea, or you're creating something, I think um, starting from your corner, from personal corner, whether it's at work or from home, you can do something new. So either it's a new dish, either, either it's a new project, either you're creating something in your room, in your bedroom, in your house, maybe you're creating a, a, a trip or something like that. So it can be a dreamy thing or it can be a very, very uh, matter of fact thing. There is some moodiness though moodiness. Probably it's an idea that crosses your mind or just a feeling, an emotion. So try to get over it without actually diving into it a lot, uh, especially if you were born on the 16th, 17th of January. Moving to Aquarius, I think Aquarians today can enjoy one of the beautiful days in this week. This is a beautiful day. It's a happy day. It encourages you to uh, bring, it will bring out the best in you of ideas, of creative things, of, uh, of having fun, of helping out, of reaching out, of moving, of writing and doing anything, whether you're a scientist, whether you're an artist, anything. This is a beautiful day, especially if you were born on the 9th, 10th, 11th of February. Moving to Pisces. Pisces, this is a nice day. It helps you to build more confidence and to discuss important things with confidence. Probably it's uh, a bill, probably it's something financial, probably it's something that you want to organize or reorganize. Uh, you have all the means to move forward. Remember that on Saturday and Sunday, the moon, new moon was in your sign. So you have all the power to start, restart, um, erase, delete, and start anew, afresh. This is a beautiful day. Uh, although the moon is not in your sign, but Pisces can move forward with big steps. You should keep your head up, your chin up, 
and you move forward. Do whatever you want to do. If you want to decide on something, decide on something. This is you. It's the new Pisces. It's a new you. So basically, this is it for Monday, the 15th. I wish you all a great day and see you tomorrow. Enjoy. Bye bye.